have a hard day in the field, Smurfs? You said it, Handy. That's for Smurf. I'm exhausted. You don't know the Smurf of it. I hate hard days. Hey, what happened to Lazy? He was supposed to help me and Grouchy pick Farmer Smurf's crops. Oh, you call Hefty. I hate Lazy. Oh, it took me hours just to fill this one cart with Smurf berries. There must be a better way to gather food. There must be a faster way. An easier way. Oh. Yeah, I just wish we knew what it was. Hmm, a better way, a faster way, an easier way. Smurfs, I have built a new machine to help you in the fields. Oh. I call it my Smurfomatic picking machine. How does it Smurf, Andy? I'll show you, Papa Smurf. Old Nick Smurf he had a farm. E-I-E-I -E Smurf. And on his farm he great Smurf. See, Papa Smurf? It can pick anything. Crops, Smurf berries. I must say it's very Smurfy, Handy. And it'll bring everything right to your house for cooking. Handy, I think your machine is going to be very popular. Come on, Smurf it up, Smurf it up, Smurf it up, Smurfette. The machine will be here soon with another load. I am, Greedy, I am. Move, Hefty, move, move. I'm Smurfing as fast as I can, Greedy. I hate smurfing as fast as I can. Oh, no! It's here! Ah! Hello in there. Everything smurfy with the peeking machine? A little too smurfy, Handy. I hate machines. Hmm. Handy! Smurfs are trying to sleep around here. Sorry, Papa Smurf. I'll try to be quieter. Please do. Sorry, Papa Smurf. <laughs> uh, thank you, Harmony. My fellow Smurfs, I will now unveil my latest and greatest invention. Ooh. It's Smurferific! It's Smurfandus! Oh, it's Smurfastic! It's Wonder Smurf! It's... Um... <laughs> Yay! What, what is it? It's a Smurfomatic food processing complex. Of course it's a Smurfomatic food processing complex. What did you think it was? I knew that right away. I said to myself, Rainy, that's a Smurfomatic. Can I help it if I'm perceptive? <clears throat> now watch every Smurf. Handy, in all my years, I have never smurfed anything like it. Thanks, Papa Smurf. We'll never have to work for our food again. Hooray! Oh, these will never, never do. Hey, Vanity, what's wrong with those cakes? Waste not, want not. I'm afraid the color of the icing clashed with my utterly smurfy complexion. I'm waiting for something in a nice purple. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, mm. Greedy, what's wrong with your food? Oh, I can't decide what to eat. But you shouldn't be wasting it. Why? There's plenty of food around. But that's not... Help! 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 Do something! I'll save your brain! What's ripping on here? Help! Gosh, 
Is every Smurf all right? Of course every Smurf's all right, thanks to me. It's a good thing I kept calm while the rest of you were panicking. You see, that's what Papa Smurf admires about me. He always says that I'm a... board leader. Look at all this wasted food. Oh, don't be no Smurf in the mud, Handy. We have plenty of food. <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> Yeah, it sure was. <laughs> I'll never forget the look on Brady's face. <laughs> <laughs> Little Smurfs seem to be developing some bad habits. No more crops left, Farmer Smurf? They're gone, Handy. And I'm afraid it'll be a few more months before new ones grow. That machine of yours is some picker. A few months? I'd better check the Smurf Fairy patches. Great Smurf! No Smurf Fairies left either! Greedy! Greedy! Greedy, how much food do you have stored? Huh? Don't you have anything stored? No, but I'm expecting another delivery any minute. Save what you can! We're running out of food! Oh, no, 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 no! Too pink! Oh, my! That will never do either! Vanity! Vanity! Is this all the food you have left? At the moment, but I've ordered something in chartreuse. Save everything you can! We're almost out of food! Oh, how absurd! I'd laugh if it didn't give me wrinkles! <laughs> from your smurf -matic food processor. It's all been wasted. The Smurf fairies are all gone. The storehouse is empty. And Farmer Smurf says no new crops for months. I'm sure you're getting all smurfed up over nothing, Handy. Now, let me get back to my work. But Papa Smurf, I... Not now. Talk to me later, Handy. Right on schedule. Huh? Hey, where's my food? Hey, where's my... The food machine's coming! The food machine's going! Uh, uh, uh. Oh, wait! My Smurf Fairies! Hey! Where are you going? Smurf back here! You forgot to Smurf me some food! I'm hungry! What's Smurfing on? I didn't get a thing today! Me neither! What happened? No. 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 Come with me, Clumsy. I know what to do. Gee, Brady, maybe Handy's right. Maybe there is no food left. No, no, no. He's just making excuses because the smurf matic watch him a smurf it isn't smurfing right. What he needs is a mechanical genius like me to fix it. Now, let's see. This doesn't look right. Uh, maybe you should wait till Handy's here, Brainy. Don't be silly, Clumsy. I know exactly what I'm doing. Oh! Oh, I think we better smurf out of here, Brainy. Clumsy, I am surprised at you. Don't you want my opinion on what we should do? Well, uh, well, sure, Brainy. What do you think we should do? I think we should smurf out of here. <laughs> Brainy, so you're the one who broke my smurf food processor. No, I was just trying to fix it. Is that all the food left? How can 100 Smurfs eat that? Uh, we can share. Maybe some Smurfs should hold on to it for a Smurf keeping. I 
that'll do it. I smirked it first. No, you didn't. I did. I'm hungry. No. Oh, no. the others to learn a lesson, Handy, and I hope you have learned a lesson. Yes, Papa Smurf. And the next time Handy builds such a Smurfy machine, you will, I trust, use it wisely. Yes, Papa Smurf. All right then, my little Smurfs, let's eat. <laughs> If it weren't for this blasted heat, this would be child's play. Hey, me! You, this wretched heat! Ah, but it's worth it. This is one scheme that'll take him by surprise. This is one scheme that will not fail. Think of it, Azriel. The destiny of the Smurfs is in my hands. Soon they will be no more. <laughs> amazing. Absolutely amazing. Phew, it's warm. Uh, perhaps I'll just join dear Lacey here in a little nap. Oh, um... Oh, Azriel, it won't be long now. Soon this dam will cut the flow of water to the river Smurf. And then those rotten little beasts will run out of water. <laughs> and when they do, they'll come up here. And when they do, with their first little tongues hanging out, I'll open the gate <laughs> and wash them all away. You know, Vanity, the mind of Smurf cannot truly soar until we stamp out the lethargy that infects our society. I was saying to Papa Smurf just the other day that it only takes... A few more hours, Azriel, and this great work will be completed. A monument to my diabolical cleverness. Unpreparedness. Just think what might have happened if that fire had smurfed at night. Oh. Just think what might have happened if this had been some smurf's house. Oh. I want you all to know I am well aware that what happened this afternoon was all my fault. Oh. When I think what might have happened to poor Lazy, I just shudder to imagine the dire consequences. That's what I love about Papa. He's so, so smurfy. Therefore, I want all of you to think very hard and come up with a plan for fighting fire. The Smurf with the smurfiest plan gets an extra Smurfberry pudding every day for a month. Yay! Greedy Smurf. 
smurf. If this isn't the silliest thing I have ever smurfed, who ever heard of a fire extinguisher that squirts whipped cream? I mean, really greedy. Just a quarter of an ounce of common sense would tell you that this system is not efficient. The whole idea of using whipped cream to smother a fire while correcting principles. Papa Smurf! You know, Harmony, this is really a waste of time. I have some plans in mind that make this contraption of yours seem naive in the extreme. Yes, as I was saying to Papa Smurf just this morning, if ever there was a need to demonstrate the folly of this kind of competitive endeavor... Papa Smurf! Hello? Hello in there, Andy Smurf. It's me, Brainy Smurf. I thought perhaps you might wish to enlist my services. No, thank you. I don't think you understand. You see, I'm offering you my insight into whatever it is you're doing. Two minds are always better than one, and... Uh... No, thank you. Oh, uh, hi, Brainy. What's going on? What is going on, Clumsy, is that Handy Smurf is up to something and foolishly excluding every Smurf from participation. I've offered to help, but oh, no. He'd rather work alone. It is attitudes like this that foster the kind of divisiveness that no well-structured Smurf society can long tolerate. And I, for one, am going to tell. Hey, Brainy, what's divisiveness? Mm. <laughs> that is the silliest thing I have ever seen, Jokey Smurf. A triumph of absurdity over Smurf sense. If you for one moment expect every Smurf to put one of those dumb boxes atop his room, you have another thing coming. How does it work anyway? Just pull that little string! <laughs> Papa Smurf! I call it the rapid wire repeating all weather extinguisher. All it takes is Smurfs to fill the buckets, Smurfs to rotate the platform, Smurfs to jump, and a Smurf, that's me, <laughs> to gauge the distance. Watch this! I know one Smurf this fall will never be dedicated to. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, poet. Oh, I really am, I really am. I told you it would never work, but oh no, you had to see for yourself. This kind of obstinacy must certainly... It won't be long, Adriel. It won't be long. It won't be long. No doubt, if Andy had taken my advice, this project, whatever it is, would have been completed days ago. But oh no, he declined my generosity. So here we are, in the middle of the night. La, 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 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, and one for the winner! Oh, Greedy, I wonder who it'll be. Every Smurf says it'll be handy. I'm certain of it myself. Oh, no, no. What are you doing? Now there won't be enough. Oh, sure there will. Grouchy hates pudding. Oh, he just says that. Oh, it's time for the announcement. Hurry! I'm coming. We want handy! We want handy! We want handy! We want handy! We want... Ooh! Wow! No doubt about it. I declare Handy Smurf the winner! <laughs> the kitchen is on fire. Handy Smurf, how does it work? Help me get into the well. Hurry, hey! hurry! I don't know. It's empty. The well is empty, too. Empty? We must take it down to the river. All of you, do what you can. Oh, my beautiful puddings. There, there, Greedy. There will be other puddings. I can't believe this. The river is dry. What do we do? I know. Let's pull the engine up to the dam. Good thinking, Smurfette. Let's go. Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. The river Smurf is dry. Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. Soon the Smurfs will really cry. Hey! Hee-ho! Hee-ho! What in the world is keeping them? Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. And no clouds up in the sky. 
There's barely enough for one loan. It will have to do. Hurry. Something is very, very wrong. Why is there no water up river? It works, Azriel. It works. Soon those despicable little blue mice will come trudging up here to see what is wrong. And if all goes well, Papa Smurf will be leading the way. <laughs> I do not understand this at all. Surely there is a logical explanation. A landslide? Oh, it's dry, dry, dry. There's no water in the sky. Gargamel, why aren't they back? Maybe they had an accident. It's the fire engine! Sara, 
Smurf. Smurf the trick? Smurfy work, Handy. Weakling, Smurf over here, will you please? A failure and incompetent. Yeah, what could they possibly hope to accomplish without the help of Weakling Smurf? Did you Smurf this for us? I've, uh, I've got a Smurf in my back. Uh, oh, uh, uh, me too. You gotta be Smurfing me. How am I ever gonna Smurf this? I don't even... Hey, I smurfed it! Oh, thanks, weakling! Yeah, you're a smurf saver! Weakling, you're smurfing great. Now, we thought you lacked smurf confidence. After all, a smurf like you who really has so very little going for him can't be expected to think too much of himself. Of course, I've never had that problem, but why get into that here? The important thing is, you're smurfing great. Here, smurf a few more. No, Brady, no! I, uh, <laughs> I thought he could smurf a few more. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't! So who knew it was hollow? Hefty, find some Smurf belts. Some Smurf stronger than me, like Baby Smurf. You can Smurf it, Weakling. Bear you, Smurf. Hey, I can Smurf it. Weakling! I need the smurfing 
he's a scrappy good fellow. Ah, Monsieur Weakling, you are the perfect smurfy specimen. Specimen? Smurfy pose, Weakling. Uh, wait a smurf painter. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Monsieur Weakling, you are the tower of strength. My time is assured. There we are, the two strongest Smurfs ever. And I owe it all to you. Well, Papa, too. Face my destiny. <gasps> Could it be? A 
after all these years of searching beyond the boundaries of time and space. At last, at last! Stop, stop, I say! Stop this race! 95, 96, 97, 98, 99... Eh, only 99 Smurfs? Two of my little Smurfs are missing. Oh, missing? Gargamel must have them. Not one Smurf, and it's all your fault, you stupid cat. No dinner for you tonight. 98, 99, no doubt about it. I took another count too, Papa Smurf. Choking and Grouchy are definitely missing. Gargamel must have smurfed them when they were in the forest. Hefty, Brainy, Vanity, Smurfette, follow me to Gargamel's. Yes, yes Papa, Papa Smurf. Smurf. The rest of you will watch over Baby Smurf. Yes, Papa, Papa Smurf. Smurf. Cats are a nuisance. You hear, Azriel? You're a nuisance, nuisance, nuisance. Azriel? Now where did you go? Azriel! Azriel! Oh, stupid cat. Now be very careful, my little Smurfs, and very, very quiet. Yes, yes Papa, Papa Smurf. Hefty and Smurfette, have a look in the cellar, and beware of Azriel. You two, come with me. Oh, it's dark in here, Hefty. Do you see anything? No, nothing. Oh, you scared me. <laughs> They're not here. Then let's go. Here, yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. Did you smurf anything? Only a rat, Papa Smurf. And he hasn't seen a thing. Hmm, that's odd. All right, quickly now. Let's smurf out of here before Asriel shows up. Here, yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. I'm sorry, my little Smurfs. Jokey and Grouchy are nowhere to be found. Oh, well, gosh, Papa Smurf, if they aren't at Gargamel's, where can they be? I don't know, Clumsy. I don't know. Papa Smurf doesn't know. What could have happened? We checked every trail. Gargamel must have them. Papa Smurf said that Gargamel doesn't have them, and if Papa Smurf said so, then Gargamel doesn't have them, because Papa Smurf is always brainy. Oh, sorry, Papa Smurf. All right. Every Smurf gets some sleep. We'll continue searching tomorrow. Oh, poor Jokey. Poor, poor Grouchy. What could have happened? Where can they be? Oh, where can they be? Beyond the boundaries of time and space, my voice has gone to stop this race. Leave where you are. Come to this place. Now come to me. Come face to face. <laughs> Just in time for supper. <laughs> Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Azriel? 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 Azriel, I have your favorite for supper. Good night, Smurfette. Good night, Hefty. Good night, Rainy. Good night, Papa Smurf. Good night, Jokey and Grouchy, wherever you are. At last, at last, to think what I have been searching for, lo, these many years, is finally in my grasp. I hate grasp! <laughs> if I could think life was such a joke, I'd cry! And then we came this way. Uh, yes, yes, I'm sure it was this way. Uh, Azriel! Here, yeah, kitty, 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 come to Gargamel! And then we came this way, Papa Smurf! Jokey! Grouchy! And now this way, uh, Azriel! Come to Gargamel. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. And I tripped on a rock right here, Papa Smurf. Jokey! Crouchy! Crouchy! Jokey! Azriel! Gargamel! Papa Smurf! What have you done with my cat, you disgusting blue bests? What have you done with my two Smurfs, Gargamel? What two Smurfs? You know very well what two Smurfs. If I had two Smurfs, I'd eat them. It would be your last meal, Gargamel. You tell him, Papa Smurf! You tell him! I'm right behind you! If you don't tell me what you've done with my cat, I'll have you all for supper! Take one more step, Gargamel, and you'll regret it! Don't make me laugh, you puny little blue runt! Be ready to run! Yes, yes Papa Smurf. Smurf! That's far enough, Gargamel! Come no closer! I'll ask you again, Papa Smurf, where is my cat? <laughs> Oh, Chlorhydrus, soon I shall be free of your curse. After all these years, to think I finally have the things I need to set me free. 
Ah, yes, here it is, here it is. Three whiskers from a yellow cat and the tear of a smurf. Oh, fortune has smiled upon me this day. I only need three whiskers and I have dozens. I only need one smurf and I have two. Freedom will soon be mine. Soon, soon, do you hear? <laughs> now, which of you will be the first to cry for me? <laughs> me cry? Don't make me laugh. I hate laughing. Cry you must, and cry you will. Uh, but first the cat. Easy, my yellow one. Easy now. <laughs> oh, I am sorry, yellow cat. Sorry. And now for that tear. It saddens me to make you cry, but I have no choice. It saddens me to tell you this, my little Smurfs, but I have no choice. We must face the possibility that Jokey and Grouchy are never coming back. Papa Smurf, say it isn't so. Please, say it isn't so. <laughs> Smurfette, we have looked everywhere, and Jokey and Grouchy are gone. Gone, gone, gone. <laughs> Asriel, are you never coming back to me? I cannot force you to cry. I can only hope that my sad tale will move you to the tear that I so desperately need. Well, my name is Priscilla. My father is dead. My mother is a sick woman. She wants nothing less than a world without love. Oh! My father was the first victim. I hate victims! Ah, uh, Priscilla, what a joy you are. I shall not be gone long, my sweet love. Be a good girl and remember how much I love you. I never saw my father again. My childhood was not a pleasant one. My toys would break. I never had any pets. There was no love in our home, and I was very lonely. This is the last one, Papa Smurf. Gosh, Painter, this is the best painting you've ever done. Looks like he can step right out of it. I wish he could, Clumsy. I miss him. I can't believe I would ever miss that fool cat. Asriel? Asriel? Go away! I can't believe they're gone. I can't believe it. Well, one day a handsome young prince arrived, and we fell in love. I don't know why my mother hated him so. I never understood her. Ah, Priscilla, my love, what a joy you are. I shall not be gone long, my sweet love. And when I return, we shall be married. And remember how much I love you. Goodbye, darling. I'll miss you. I never saw my prince again. There you go, Asriel. Get him, get him. Get him, you fool cat. Asriel, Asriel, is that you? Oh. And then, so that no one would ever love me, she turned me into the hag you see before you. Oh, the many years I've spent suffering the mockery of the peasants. Wobbly, wobbly, there goes ugly. Wobbly, wobbly, there goes ugly. Wobbly, wobbly, there goes ugly. Alas, your eyes are dry. I see my tale has not moved you to tears. I hate tears. I never cry. <laughs> That's why they call me Jokey. You only have Smurfette here. She cried for you. My time is running out, and without a tear, I'll stay like this forever. Well, um, can we go home? Yes. Oh, I am sorry, Yellow Cat. If I could give you back your three whiskers, I would. And as the river Smurf flows, so the river of life flows into the endless sea. And as every loving Smurf knows, the memory of loving grows and grows, and they shall always be. I hate this. I think I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I, I forgive you, Mother. Oh. Now can we go home? 97, 98, 99, 100, and 1! Yay! I 
don't know why I bother even feeding you, you worthless stupid cat. I'd be better off without you. <laughs> now, where, where, where did I put that book? Ah, here it is. Modern Magic. Uh, mummy, I, 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 uh, uh, yeah! Get off, you fool! I brought Madame Lavinia, the marriage broker. She's arranged for you to meet your future bride. F -f -f future bride? Yes! I've decided it's high time you got married. Yeah, but I don't want to get married. Oh, of course you do. Think how happy your father was. Yeah. Your future husband will be arriving today at noon, so you'd better get your hope chest in order. But, Father, it's empty. I haven't saved anything for my wedding. Andrea, it was your responsibility to fill your hope chest. A full hope chest is the sign of a good wife-to-be. Oh, what am I gonna do? You better find something for your hope chest, or the gentleman may refuse to marry you. Oh, dear. Oh, Howard, aren't these flowers just beautiful? Hmm, yes, they're very inspiring. <laughs> What's that? Oh, my! Look! A maiden in distress! She looks so sad! I must find out what's wrong. Oh, Smurfette! Don't be afraid. I mean no harm. Y you don't look dangerous. Oh, we're not. We're Smurfs. And we want to help you. I'm afraid no one can help me. Today I'm to meet my husband-to-be, but when he sees that I have nothing in my hope chest, he probably won't marry me. <laughs> what do you put in a hope chest? Oh, all kinds of things for your new home after you get married. Oh, we Smurfs have lots of nice things for a hope chest. Right, poet? Certainly. I can even compose a wedding poem for you. I'll call it An Ode to Marriage. Oh, I'm afraid it's too late. My future husband will be arriving in less than two hours. Oh, don't worry. Just stay right here. We'll be back in no time with plenty of things for your hope, Jess. Gee, Papa Smurf, are you sure you don't need my help? Um, uh, yes. Yes, there is something. You can return this map of the forest to Handy. Oh, thank you, Papa Smurf. Hmm. This map is really complete. It even shows the location of our village. Smurfette, here's the pie you wanted. And my painting! It's a surprise! <laughs> well, I wonder what they're up to. Oh, thank you, thank you, every Smurf! Now, what is going on here? I'm collecting gifts for a maiden in distress. Smurfette! Smurfette! I've just finished my wedding poem. Well, I certainly wish I could help you, Smurfette. Oof! Oh, I'm sorry, Brainy. I'm in a hurry. No kidding. I just hope Handy's map isn't damaged. What's this? Oh, no! Poet must have taken the map. And after you get married, I'm gonna make sure your wife gets rid of that flea-bitten cat. But, but, but I'm too young to get married. You'll change your mind when you see how beautiful the Baron's daughter is. Yeah, and don't forget her hope chest. The hope chest? That's right. I rather imagine a hoop chest belonging to a baron's daughter should contain some items of great value. And there's a doily from Taylor, and a little horn, some turnips from Farmer, and a painting of Baby Smurf. And don't forget my wedding poem. How wonderful! Now at least I'll have something to put in my hope chest. I must hurry back. Oh, thank you so much. Good luck, Andrea. Oh, how romantic. I only wish we could be there when she finally meets the man of her dreams. Squire Gargamel from Hovel Farms. Oh, Father, I hope he likes me. Get in there. No, no, I won't. You heard me. No, you can't make me. Oh, yeah? Yeah! What is the meaning of this? Oh, you must excuse the boy. He's very shy, but, but quite charming. Go ahead. Say something to the girl. Uh, uh, what's in this hope chest I've been hearing about? Over there. Uh, this had better be good. <laughs> what a sense of humor. Ah, this hope chest looks pretty hopeless, Azriel. Ah, now this looks interesting. 
marry that person? No, now you're just nervous, Andrea. Besides, your father has already promised your hand in marriage, and by custom, only Squire Gargamel can decide to call off the wedding. Hmm, there's something awfully smurfy about this oak chest. What's this? Ye, ye gads! It's a map to the Smurf's village! Azriel, I must have this map! Madam Lavinia, it is obvious to me that Gargamel has no interest in marrying my daughter. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, there's nothing that I want more than to marry your daughter. Then, according to social custom, this engagement is final. Oh, father! <laughs> My, the girl is overcome with joy. Well then, so be it. The wedding is set for tomorrow morning. Oh, Gargamel, you made your mummy so happy. You're welcome, mummy. Oh, no. You mean we gave Maiden Andrea a map to our village? Exactly. And we must smurf it back before it falls into the wrong hands. Quickly, we've got to find Andrea. Andrea! Smurfette? What are you doing here? We came to get back a map to our village, which I gave you by mistake. That's why we brought Papa Smurf. But why are you crying? Didn't your husband-to-be like your hope, Jeff? <laughs> Only too well. Tomorrow morning, I shall be the bride of Squire Gargamel. <laughs> Gargamel? Squire? Oh! I can't tell you what an awful man he is. If there was only some way to stop this wedding. Maybe we can help you. But first, we have to get our map back. Could you tell us where it is? It's in my hope chest, which my father has put on display in, in the banquet room for my wedding reception. <laughs> then we're not too late. Come, my little Smurfs. Everyone must be asleep by now. If I can get my hands on that map tonight, I can sneak away, catch the Smurfs, and become a rich man without getting married! <laughs> oh, oh, it's locked, Papa Smurf! I was afraid of that. Here, try this knife. See if you can spring the lock. Uh, oh, oh, Papa Smurf, I have it! It's open! And I have you! <laughs> Try to hide, you fools! Push, boy! Push! Huh? Yow! Ow, 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 ow! Squire Gargamel! Baron! Practicing for the dance? Or perhaps you were trying to break into the hoop chest? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, not me! Well, then, who? Uh, well, uh, 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 the Smurfs. Smurfs? Yes, you know, those little blue creatures. Squire Gargamel, have you gone mad? But, but, but really, I mean, you don't... I'll I mean, just but, keep but, this in my bedroom really, for I mean, safekeeping. I... Now go to sleep, Gargamel. One more outrage from you, and the wedding is off. Understand? How are we going to get the map if the chest is locked in the Baron's bedroom? We'll just have to wait until he opens the door. But how long will that be? Baron! Oh, Baron! Wake up, my little Smurfs. Someone is coming. Baron, you'd better hurry. The wedding is soon to begin. Yes, yes, I'm ready. Oh, you should see your daughter, Baron. Oh, she can hardly contain herself. Now, let's get this over with. Oh, no. Papa Smurf, it's locked again. Oh, my, and the wedding has started. All we can do now is stop the wedding, or Gargamel's going to get our map. Follow me. <laughs> I sure hope your idea works, Papa Smurf. So do I. It just has to work. Do you, Andrea, take Spire Gargamel to be your husband? Uh, I... I guess I have no choice. I do. <laughs> and do you, Gargamel, take Andrea to be your wife? I do. Huh? Let's get going. Said, do you, Gargamel? The map! My map! Come back here, you! You rats! What is that madman doing? 
He's leaving the chapel! Quick, into the banquet hall! Stop, I say! I'll get you! I'll get you if it's... <laughs> you can't get away from me! Whoa. Oh, look out! Carcamel! Now I've got you! <laughs> you fool! You maniac! You better have a good excuse for this insanity! But, but, but it was the Smurfs, I tell you. They were stealing this map from your daughter's hope chest. See? Huh? It's empty. I've been tricked. That does it! Social custom or no social custom, the wedding is off! I want you and your filthy cat out of my castle at once! Guards, throw this maniac out! Here's your map, Papa Smurf. And thank you all. Ah, <sighs> yes. But I can't help feeling sorry for Gargamel. He could have had a lovely bride if he had set his greed aside. Yes, I bet he regrets it even now. Just wait until we get home. Are you gonna get it? Ouch! But, Mummy... And don't think I've forgotten about my commission. I expect to be paid in full for my efforts. Oh, he'll pay all right. Boy, will he pay. Oh, my word. Hush, little darling. We'll be there soon. Shh, there are bad fairies about. Oh, look, darling. There's the entrance to Grandfather's cave. Grandfather, it's Fauna. Well, 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 what a pleasant surprise. Come in, child. <laughs> Your voice, Grandfather. It sounds different. <coughs> it's the damp weather, my dear. But here, let me hold the prince. <laughs> I think he's afraid of your hood, Grandfather. Give me that rebel, child. You're not yourself, Grandfather. That's because I'm not your grandfather. <laughs> Fallon! <laughs> yes, Fallon, your favorite fallen fairy. Oh, no! Yeah. <laughs> Give me the magic rattle, and I'll spare your wretched lives. Never. Yeah. This is called a Smurf cake. Give me that rattle. Rattle? Sorry. <laughs> From up there, you look like someone else. Uh, I don't suppose you've seen a fairy queen and her baby hereabouts? Uh, 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 fairy queen? No, I can see you haven't. Whew, that was a close call. For a minute, I thought he was going to smurf our food. Oh, I'm so hungry. No, no. Now, this is what I call a smurf kebab. See? No, no. <laughs> oh, that looks delicious. Hey, you're in the tree. Oh, dear. You stole our food. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, sir. Come down here so I can smurf you a piece of my mind face to face. Oh, we dare not expose ourselves. That evil fairy may yet be lurking about. All right, then. Just smurf back my smurf kebab and I'll... Hush, baby. I'll be right down. Down? No! Did I? Was I? No, I, I couldn't have. <coughs> Osriel! <coughs> and if that awful Fallon ever gets the magic rattle, he will control all the good fairies and spread mischief throughout the forest. Good heavens! Smurf home. <laughs> now, now, we'll visit again sometime. Rock-a-bye, baby, in the tree top. 
when the wind blows. Gosh, Grady, we were getting worried about you, too. Look at that poor child, completely smurfed out. Whew, me too. Uh-oh, baby's all wet. What do we do, Brady? Clumsy. Don't you know anything about babies? It's time I taught you how to smurf a dighty. Oh, gee, Brainy, I'd rather smurf just about anything than a dighty. Anything? <laughs> okay, I'll change the dighty. Golly, looks like a cyclone smurfed your place. Hurry up and smurf off the table so I can change baby on it. <laughs> <laughs> It's all right, baby. Brainy will have you smurf in a minute. Clumsy, get me some powder out of the closet. Oh, okay, Brainy. <laughs> clumsy, clumsy, clumsy. This mess has to be cleaned up. What? How? <laughs> Brainy, how did you do that? It wasn't me. I think it was Baby. <laughs> baby Smurf, come back here! <laughs> Gee, Baby's powdered! Stop that, Baby Smurf! <laughs> oh, dear! Somebody grab the baby! You ruined my garden! Mm, C'est magnifique! Ah, this is my masterpiece! <laughs> Cordon Bleu! See me, Papa Smurf? Greedy, when you took Baby Smurf on that picnic, did you meet any wizards or goblins or fairies? 
Uh, yes, Papa Smurf, a fairy queen and her little son, Prince Fenwick. Hmm. Baby Smurf and the prince must have switched rattles. Yes, and I'm here to switch them back. <gasps> for for Fallon, the fallen fairy? I'm afraid so, Greedy. Give me the magic rattle. It belongs to Queen Fauna and Prince Fenwick. And unless you give it to me, Fenwick, Fauna, and her grandfather will perish. <laughs> Greedy, I'm afraid we have no choice. We cannot take the chance. Quickly, Greedy. Feathers! Brainy! Clumsy! Hurry! We must follow Fallon to his castle. But Papa Smurf, what if Fallon uses the scepter's magic against us? I cover the rattle with anti-magic powder to render it powerless for one hour. But what if it takes more than an hour to get to Fallon's castle? <sighs> then I'm afraid Fallon will control all Fairyland and fill the world with mischief. Faster, Feathers, faster! <laughs> oh, how I've dreamed of this moment. The magic rattle is mine at last. Easy, Sabra. Soon you'll be dining royally <laughs> on three members of royalty. Fallon, you monster! You have the rattle! Why destroy us? <sighs> That's just the way I am. <laughs> Fauna, look! The Smurfs! Smurfs? I know how to take care of them. <laughs> what? The rattle has lost its magic, Fallon. Surrender! Curse it, rattle! Do your magic! I command you! Very well, Papa Smurf. You have the magic rattle, but it's as useless to you as it was to me. <gasps> there is no way you can save them, Papa Smurf. Victory is still mine! My anti-magic dust should be wearing off any second. Come on, magic rattle! Oh, gee, Papa Smurf, you don't suppose we got the wrong rattle again? No, Clumsy, this is the right rattle. Please, Papa Smurf, do something! Come on, Rattle! Come on, come on! Do your magic! Papa Smurf commands you! My throne! You've destroyed my throne! I'm not through with you yet, young Fenwick! Nor you, Papa Smurf! I'll rebuild my throne. And someday, I shall have the magic rattle! 